In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can download audiobooks onto your MP3 player using Georgia Download Destination. And the first thing you'll want to do is go to gadd.lib.overdrive.com and type that into your browser and go to the Georgia Download Destination website and you'll want to click on the quick start guide link and download and install free software and in order to use the service you'll need to install a piece of software called overdrive media console so click here and from the overdrive media console website you'll want to come come down the page and click where it says download now Windows version 3 and click on that link to download and once you've done that you can go back to the home page on Georgia download destination and in the middle of the page they have a listing of some of the new mp3 audiobooks that are available and you can also click on a complete list and if you only want to see the titles that are currently available place a little check mark in this box only show titles with copies available and click submit and this will limit your results to just those audiobooks that are currently available for you to to, uh, to download so let's go ahead and download one we're going to download a, a book called Amber's Mirage and you'll see that that is an mp3 audiobook and it plays on iPods or any mp3 player and you can also use it on uh, there's a WMA file that you can use on mp3 players so what you want to do is click add to cart and you'll see here that the lending period is for seven days but we can change that what you'll do is click proceed to checkout and you'll have to select your library so if your card is from Statesboro Regional Public Libraries you'll want to select Statesboro Regional Public Libraries from the drop-down list and type in your library card number and your password that you've created and click sign in and you'll want if you would want it for longer than seven days there's a drop down menu and you can select a 14 day checkout and we'll just do seven days and you will want to scroll down and it says you can only have five titles out at one time and this will let you know how many titles you currently have checked out so we're going to go ahead and click confirm checkout and then on this next page it tells you uh, when you checked out the book audiobook and when the book is going to be due back and there's nothing that you need to do it automatically will delete itself from your your computer so what you do is click download and a window will pop up and you want to make sure that open with overdrive media console is selected click OK and then you want to click OK again and with the audiobooks you can download them you don't have to download the entire audiobook all at one time you can download it in, in parts so this is actually 
quicker if you download the parts individually. So if you want to, you can uncheck part two, and we're just going to download part one, and then click OK. And there's a status bar, a green status bar down here that shows you your progress. And when it turns completely green, your audiobook will be downloaded to your computer. And once that's done, you can listen to it on your computer, or if you have an MP3 player such as an iPod, you can click the transfer button and transfer it to your device. And that concludes this tutorial.